There are about a dozen tents scattered throughout James Bay Irvine Park. Each one is soaking wet after hours of rain. This is where Neil Dwyer pitched his tent last week. Because uh, the other day they came down to Pandora and took everybody's tents and kicked us off the block down there. On Thursday, bylaw moved in and moved out the tents and belongings of the residents living in the 40 to 50 tents on the 900 block of Pandora, including Dwyer. He doesn't have access to methadone because he's worried if he leaves the park to get it, someone will steal his tent. So he's back to using fentanyl. Now he says his life and the life of others evicted from Pandora is much harder. Because that's where the pharmacy is, that's where the clinic is, that's where our place is, that's where access to everything is the medical, that's where the, the mobile van for Kool Aid comes, you know. And out here, there's nothing. The mayor told the media last week that the Pandora sweep was nothing out of the ordinary. Uh, it is a difficult, difficult place to manage. Uh, and uh, I'm absolutely confident that our staff are doing the same job they do every day. But those who live and work on the block say it was anything but ordinary. And today, still many are too afraid to return, yet have nowhere else to go. We run a small shelter that is uh, at a capacity of 30 beds and we are turning people away seven days a week um, so that's even in the spring with the nice weather um, the, the need is definitely there. Advocates for the city's unhoused say the sweep ultimately pushed people further into isolation a dangerous move during an overdose epidemic. Add in the wet weather and it's made day-to-day -day life harder than ever. I can't imagine uh, what it's like when you're out there and your socks are wet and you're trying to find help that is difficult to line up or maybe it doesn't exist. Uh, how difficult it is to remain enthusiastic when you're in that and then to have somebody pushing you around and telling you uh, you can't be here anymore and throwing your stuff out. As for Dwyer and others sheltering here, they hope they can at least tent in the park until they find somewhere more permanent.